morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. Get you right. Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, y'all. It is Sunday and we're out to make some money. You see, we already made some money so already. Y'all already see that at early in the morning. I'm starting to see people love donuts. People love coffee. Oh, thought that was an order coming in. Because I thought since it being Sunday that, hold on. If you're new to the channel, I'm your boy Hustle Man Core. I do like gear work for us, Walmart, Spark, DoorDash, Uber Eats, and all the rest of them. But subscribe. Do me a favor. It's free. Subscribe. But anyway, I thought today was going to be kind of a problem with uh, getting orders early because a thing that I'm working on with Chick-fil-A, they don't open on Sundays. So guess who showed me some love? Dunkin' Donuts and Krispy Kreme. So that's how that play out. But um, what happened with that Walgreens order earlier in the video? Um, the store was open, but they only had one person there. So um, they had to keep the store closed. So I had to cancel the order. So I lost what, five something dollars since they didn't have an extra person to work, which was fucked up, but it's cool. We'll make it back anyway. But today's not going to be a long day. Right now we're getting gas. Um, we only plan. Hey, how much it costs to fill this tank up? This is my first time really filling it. Oh yeah, then yeah. The thing just rolling. We over forty dollars. I thought it probably took thirty. Oh, forty-three dollars and ten cents. Hold on one moment. But as I was saying, it's Sunday. Um, we only plan to come out. It's gonna be a very short day. Um, if we get our goal quick, then I might stay out a little longer. But I only plan to make $106 today. And y'all already seen your boys already at, what, probably $30 already. So we might stay out a little longer since we got, we getting it to our goal a little faster. So, um, but, um, we got an order for Bojangles. So I'm, y'all probably gonna see me take some bad orders because I gotta get my acceptance rate right back up above 50 because right now it's at 49. So we want to keep it above 50. So um, we gotta run the Bojangles right quick and pick this order up and catch y'all there. All right, Hustle Gang. We delivered that second one to the person and the payout was uh, DoorDash pay of $3, peak pay of $2. One person tipped 250, the other one tipped 350 with a total for 11 dollars. And let go. All right, Hustle Gang. First Walmart Spark order of the day will be a pickup. It will be a pickup of three different customers for $21.64 for 7.5 miles. We're here now sitting at one. And I noticed when I was checking in, they have updated when, you know, you gotta scroll all the way down and then hit save, but I hit one and the save button came up. So thank you Walmart Spark correcting that so now all you gotta do is just bring this order out to me catch out when we deliver all right hustle game so i do know at least at the store i'm at that they're pushing i don't know if it's a walmart spark thing or it's a walmart store manager thing but they are pushing that you cannot have anyone in the car with you if you're delivering smart which it doesn't make sense um, because the car that was parked to me, I guess he was picking up a spark order and, um, he had a passenger. The man said, well, I can't give it to you. He was like, why? Because you got a passenger. My manager is, is, you know, pushing us that we can't. He was like, well, I just been to another Walmart photos and she was in the car with me when I did a pickup. So is it, I wonder if it's certain ones or is Walmart spark is actually trying to push this doesn't make sense. It doesn't. For subcontractors, come on, you're trying to control us. Why are you trying to control everything we do? But next day gonna be telling me my little duckies can't rob me, right? Like, like, come on, man. Catch up with the level. 
All right, guys, we have delivered two orders so far. Um, the customers have met us outside, but the second one gave us a little bit of trouble. I don't know what's going on with the GPS. It's leading me this place, lead me that place. But uh, she was able to call me and tell me where she was at, and we got another address and delivered it to her. So now, going away to the third one. So whew, let's keep it moving. All right, let's get off this college campus, y'all. I'm tired of delivering to these students. It's too much running around. But you can tell that it's spring break. It's real quiet around here. Right now, I'm on the campus of University of South Carolina. Shout out to them girls from Girl Game Cops, too. Coming up with that win last night. Um, yeah, I was trying to do a little bit of DoorDash over here because in my other area where I go at, it's not letting me on, so, but we tired dealing with these costumes because they ain't tipping. And if they is, they ain't tipping nothing but a couple dollars. But I ain't gonna, you know, whatever, you know, they, they barely got a little couple dollars in their pocket. So it is what it is. I did my good deed for the day. Now I gotta go make my money. So maybe we're probably gonna make our way back to Walmart. Or maybe DoorDash might turn us on once we get in the area where we're going to uh, dash. Dash. But until then, Catch you till next time. All right, y'all look like we going shopping for 11 funky ass dollars at Walmart. And we only going, how many miles we going? 6.4 miles. And it's only five items, probably which is four. Let go. Gang, that was the first time that ever happened to me. But she had to sign, you know, signature for the medicine. And she was born the same year I was born and the same day. That's crazy, ain't it? Look at that sun. Stop trying to shine while I'm shining. Get out my video, cuz. Get out my video. Goddamn sun. God damn, I don't want to go to McDonald's, man. DoorDash, you better be lucky my darn things at 50% right now. That's the only reason why I'm going there. So see y'all at Mickey D's, please. God damn, Marley. Mr. No Tip Marley, what's up? Yeah, I got your food, man. The man ordered just a basket of fries, extra, extra salt. Really? You gonna use DoorDash just to order some fucking fries and don't tip? You full of shit. For real. Like, first of all, you don't need to be eating no damn fries with all that extra salt, man. It ain't good for you, man. It ain't good. But don't worry. I got your hot, ready fries ready to go with extra, extra salt. I even I grabbed some more salt packets for you. Good luck with your uh, french fries. Plus the game, this is when I leave you here. We're done for the day. I'm going to enjoy my sunny Sunday outside doing things with my son or whatever. And um, first of all, I want to say thank y'all guys for watching. Thank you guys for subscribing. And now uh, let's go ahead and run in totals for the day. Like I told you, we came out just to make $100. We got that in some. So, um, 
<sighs> we did Walmart Spark and DoorDash for today. As far as uh, Walmart Spark that didn't do the leading today. We did $21.61 for trip earnings with $11.03 as far as uh, unconfirmed daily tip. Which we're cool with that because we want all our money from this week on one check. So we don't want to make good money with tips and then we got to get it next week. So DoorDash, the Dasher. We had a uh, one, two, three, four dashes, one for $29, one for $12.50, one for $24, and the last one for $29.80. Um, it was a little different today. I'm guessing because I didn't get the Chick-fil-A, but we still started off strong early this morning. I thought the whole day was gonna be like that, but it kind of changed and slowed up a little bit, but it still ended up paying out. So um, we finished with a total of $127.92, not bad for a, just working to 12, so now it's time to relax and enjoy the rest of my day, so once again, thank you guys for watching, thank you guys for subscribing, and keep posting my friends.